Recent events in Chad have seen a tragic death of opposition activist Yaya Dilo, who died from injuries suffered during an attack on the headquarters of the Socialist Party Without Borders. The news of his death was confirmed by the public prosecutor Omar Kebelaye. Several people were injured in the attack and 26 people have been arrested in connection with the incident. The attack on the PESF headquarters was predicted by the separate attack on the National Security Agency building in Jamina, attributed to supporters of Yaya Dilo. Yaya Dilo, a cousin to Chad's current president, Mohamed Idris Debi Idno, had narrowly escaped a previous arrest attempt three years ago in which his mother and one of his sons tragically lost their lives. These distributing events have taken place in the run-up to the presidential election schedule for May 6. The series of violent incidents and political tensions have cast a shadow over Chad's political landscape and raised concerns about stability and security in the region. Yaya Dilo's untimely death has added this complexity, leaving many questions unanswered and further falling uncertainty about the upcoming election.